do you think? Hmm? First, we're going to blacken the windows, then we're going to set up the electric candles and centerpieces. Okay, um, do you have the iPad with the guest list? Check! And I am so excited that local celebrity bird whisperer Carl Berkeley is going to be here tonight. Well, anything for Brad. Oh, anything. Um, uh, Brooke, <clears throat> Brooke, um, hey, can... <sighs> you are doing it all wrong, Brooke, all wrong! How can you even tell? How can I tell? Well, okay. Well, I can smell that pleather jacket you're wearing, first of all. And second of all, this is not the Sons of Anarchy party you threw sophomore year. That no one attended, okay? Think bigger, Brooke. Huh? Yeah, this party has to actually be lit, so... Mm -hmm. Oh, 100 P, baby. Oh, it's no darty, but it's gonna be five for show. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yo, this, uh, this party's gonna be smack, dudes. I can't wait to lose myself in the music, in the moment. Groovy times all around. D did you just listen to anything we just said? No, it? did you say darty? Yep. Uh, yeah, this is like really sad. This is kind of like watching my grandmother try to knit a crop top. <laughs> oh, stop being so hard on Brooke. She's a senior. And I happen to think that seniors are adorable. I saw one at Noodles and Company the other day eating alone. It was heartbreaking. Oh, well, luckily I have the support of my great friends who are gonna help me. Oh, wait, 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 oh. God, did I forget my wardrobe change? Oh. Oh, no, you were gonna do Christina. I was, but if I wanted to go all out, I would've done Fergie, but I gotta, I'll be right back, okay? Finally, the, uh, the adults can have a moment. You know, the showrunners, the head dogs brew in London fogs. Uh, to be honest, Brooke, you've learned nothing about beer. <clears throat> and you're a terrible bartender. But I'm gonna miss having you around. You know, I've never, uh, had so many customers tell a waitress to cool it with, uh... Okay, to be fair, I'm very much alone, so... <sighs> All I'm trying to say is I'm gonna miss you. But it's not like you're gonna miss this place, I mean... It's not like you got a college degree to work your uh, student job forever, right? <laughs> oh, you, who are you? Huh? Uh, uh, no one ordered. I'd prefer it if you uh, turned around. <laughs> what are you ladies up to? Just trying to make sure everything is perfect. What's the occasion? Are you saying you haven't been debriefed about Brad's birthday yet? Oh my, I can't, I can't believe he left the hole this huge, like... Wait, there's gonna be a party for Brad? Yeah. yeah. Here? Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's pretty cool he's gonna be driving all the way from Utah. What? what? Oh yeah, he didn't tell you? He got a job at his old high school, uh, something about coaching the soccer team? No, he was supposed to be here in 45 minutes. That's it. The fun's done. No, 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 no. Simon's heart will not be broken tonight. Uh, look, uh, anyway, this is the show. Cheese and burnets. 
I can tell you've been to O'Toole's already. Damn it, Brooke, I was hoping we could have one night out and forget all of our responsibilities. That sounds great, but what's with the giant suitcase? I just got back from LA, actually. Turns out there isn't really a prestigious market for extras. You would think it would be all strawberry lemonade and satin slippers, but next thing you know, it's women 26 to 32 slapping each other over who's gonna hold the baby in a target spot. And when you're picky about jobs, your landlord sometimes gets a little fussy over paying your rent on time or getting too many noise violations because you're up late at night sobbing and waking the neighbor's baby. Yikes. Yeah, everyone's impossible to work with. You would think just having a dream is enough. Lorelai? I'm here. Anyways, it looks like you're settling down for the night, so I'll see you soon, hopefully. Because I'll be here! Around! That's a nice Dolce & Gabbana bag. <sighs> that was sacrilegious, but I appreciate your effort. Those kids and their hip lingo. I, oh, they think they're so cool because they know all the latest slang. They have no respect for me. And like, okay, yeah, I'm a couple years older, but that doesn't mean I'm not cool anymore. Like, ugh. And you know what? I looked up darty in the dictionary, and guess what? It's not in there. <laughs> I mean, how dare they show me such disrespect? I'm an adult. I am mature. Composed. Yeah. You know, so what if I don't have a job figured out after college or like even a job in mind? I'm gonna be a college grad. The world is my oyster. You know, just because Liz had everything going for her when she was in college, but you know, who am I to compare myself to? Someone who recently graduated with the same degree. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. This is my old dorm room. <laughs> I haven't been here in decades. Uh, oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, Brooke, I am rich. Uh, I'm here to help you with your final arrangements. Am I dying? <laughs> no, your parents are. <laughs> kidding! Kidding! <laughs> I'm here in servitude of the Alumni Association. Um, it is our goal to try to get you on track for graduation. So, now, uh, my records indicate that you are unmotivated, you are irresponsible, and you are often very bad at puns. More like <laughs> pun successful. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Yeah, well, uh, okay, what's going on here, and why do you smell like the cheesy gordita crunch I ate yesterday? Ouch, we just met, you're already gordita holding me? I'm dead, okay? I'm a ghost. I see. Now, look, you see, I donated and donated and donated my vast fortune to the Alumni Association until before I knew it, I'd given them my very soul. So I am damned to haunt the banks of the Red Cedar until I can help one, just one, lost soul. One desperate drifter. One runt of the pack find their way. Am I in what not to wear? <laughs> no! no! Look, I'm here to get you on track so I can move on. And you get a bright future, so all the best. Don't you see? This room, you lost me dead. Gordita Crunch. Bright future. The stars are aligning! Okay. Oh, so you can get your wings and go to heaven. No. So I can open up my own taco truck business with my dog, Dodger. <laughs> He's my best friend. <laughs> okay. Okay. Everyone get in position. Brad will be here any minute. <clears throat> what are we doing? Mm. No, sweet. Follow my lead. Oh, okay. Keep going. Oh, 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 hey. Okay. Listen, 
I know you're really being ambitious, Ricardo, but listen, I don't want to be like Meryl Streep covered in flour, okay? So could you please call it, please? All right, all right. Okay. All right, <clears throat> everyone here? Brad will be here soon, so everyone get into their positions. He's always on time. Oh, my God, that's one of the, that's one of the things I really like about him. Um. Oh, my God. Look alive, people, come on! Speechless. <laughs> that, that's, that, that's okay. Um, you know, I can wait for a thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Simon. <laughs> <laughs> So, how does the whole getting me on the right track thing work? So tonight you will be meeting three working professionals. So, is that what you're going to be wearing? Because we're FaceTiming the first guy in about five minutes. We were FaceTiming? Yes, it's 2016, sweetheart. Deal. I'm going to introduce you to Pat. You see, Pat used to live down the hall from me. Well, that was until 1990 when he got kicked out for running a campus-wide pyramid scheme. Totally kidding. Uh, but if there's anyone who can weasel you to the top, it's him. So I would lose that and maybe go with the pleather. Oh, look, oh, it's him. I guess golden girl it up. Look, just move it to the offshore accounts. It's not that difficult. And make sure no one knows. Oh, hi, Rich. So my secretary tells me you're dead? Yes, dead is a doornail. And how's that working out for you? Well, you know. Can't complain. The hours are... <laughs> and uh, this must be Brooke. Yes. Hi, Brooke. Uh, get me a flat white, won't you? We're not even in the same state. Possibly the same country. I'm sorry. It's just you look so much like an intern. And you're right. I'm in an undisclosed exotic location near international waters. It's okay. Uh, so, you there for a vacation? <laughs> a vacation? <laughs> yes. Yes, a vacation. Now here, Brooke, the thing about the future you have to remember is that it's not a marathon, it's a race. <laughs> I don't think that Do you think there are other cats out there that are worried about being lost or not knowing what they want to do with their lives? <laughs> no, they're out there making money. Dollars, pounds, lira, deutschmark, yen. So what exactly do you do? I'm in technology, let's say. But the real question is, Brooke, what do you do? Um, Wrong. You get out there, and you take everything you can from everybody you can. Okay. Uh, just remember, the ends don't necessarily justify the means. <laughs> Especially when you're signing a deal with China, and the company CEO is clearly a toddler. <laughs> Hold on a second. So what does he do? Oh, you heard him. Uh, technology. What does that mean? Is it legal? Uh, sure, yeah. At least 50% of it. Oh, better make that 30. Well, it's fantastic down here. It's beautiful. The properties are fantastic. Oh, yeah. I'll send you some pictures. All right, cheerio. Oh, so you're looking at properties, like houses? Uh, houses? Properties? No. No. Uh, listen, uh, Brooke, I've got some things to uh, attend to, but I'm, I'm going to leave you with one last little bit of advice. If you have a senator in your pocket, you can basically get away with murder. Okay. Great. Cheerio. <laughs> Holy, you son of a gun! How are the kids, huh? Hmm? How about that for advice? I had never heard the thing about a senator before. But it's good advice. Are you kidding me? Everything that guy was saying was awful. But, but what did you learn? That I look like an intern? Maybe I should be an intern. Yikes. We have a long way to go. <laughs> Brad, are you going to blow out your candles and make a wish? <laughs> Good. Are you going to tell me what you wish for? Huh? Oh, you can tell me. No, Brad, you can't. Then it won't come true. Everyone knows that. Ellen, not now. Please! <sighs> Sorry. 
Sorry. Ricardo! Uh, spritz, please. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Okay, let's dance, shall we? Can someone put on some music, please? <clears throat> okay, Brad, you're with me, of course. Uh, partner up, everyone, partner up. Brad. Oh, good choice. Oh. Brad, where? Uh, oh. Brad, you seem very stiff. Do you need a massage? No, no I'm good. <laughs> Okay, so the next alumni, you're going... Are you going to stick with the whole nightgown yep. thing? Okay. Next, you're going to meet Steve. Now, Steve used to be my roommate here in this very room way back when. I think you're really going to like him. He's very liberal-thinking, young-minded. He's essentially a man-sized toddler. Um, oh, look, and here he is. It's a little spooky, but it's fun. Let's see. Hi, Steve! Where is he? Wait for it. Hey guys! How's it going? Brooke! Hey, 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 hey! Pick a card. Any card. Any card at all. Any card. We're not even in the same room. Right. Right. But know that I am capable of great feats if, of course, we were in the same room at the, at the same time. <laughs> so what do you do, Steve? Oh, uh, uh, isn't it clear? I am a magician. You were right about this one, Rich. <laughs> <laughs> See, I should get paid as a magician? Well, yes and uh, no. I, I did spend some time with Nintendo of America, Inc. Uh, there's a little difference of uh, vision over Super Mario Kart 9. Uh, really a discrepancy over the number of uh, Koopa shells and banana peels. But I digress. And that is where I grab your card. You didn't even do anything. But I could do it. That's what's important. That doesn't pay any money. You sound just like my mom. Latte, latte, aqua con leche. And that's where the water in my head turns to milk. Why milk? Why are you always questioning my decisions, Mom? I mean, I mean, Brooke? tell you is that life post-grad is hard. I mean, it's really difficult, but what you just need to do is you just need to pick something you're passionate about, something you love, and just do it. And it doesn't matter if you're good at it. I mean, you can stink and not be good at all. I mean, at all. <laughs> One more thing, Brooke. Was that your card? <laughs> no. Was that your card? No. Were any of these your card? <laughs> Was it a red card? Did it have Steve. a face? Steve! Coming, mother! Dinner's ready. <laughs> he lives with his mom. His mom, his wife, we're not sure. <laughs> Okay, Bradley, now it's time for the big dip. One, two, three, oh, go! Oh. <laughs> Brad, I know you're a better dancer than that, come on. Brad? Uh, uh, Simon, I'm sorry, it's my birthday. <laughs> yeah, thank you for remembering to invite me. Yeah, I was just so excited about being a part of everything. Uh, okay, 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 um, what are you three up to? Nothing. Oh, come on. Where's Brad? Hmm? <sighs> Your friend's not coming, amigo. He hit the road and is out exploring the Wild West. Um, okay. Utah? If it makes a difference. He, he left? Without saying goodbye? I bought an iPad for all this. Oh, he just didn't have the tools to say goodbye, mm. you know? Yeah, and by tools she meant beer, and by didn't, she meant did, and he was really drunk. Okay, thank you. Okay, it's not that he didn't want to come. Wait, 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 wait. shut up. Okay, okay. You guys 
would have done this all night? Yeah. Yeah. Huh. I don't know why, but I kind of like that. Oh, okay, well, if you like that, you should see what we use. No. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I already know too much. Didn't you say there was one more ghost? I mean, working professional we were supposed to be meeting with? There is indeed one more ghost you're going to be speaking with. Neil? Neil? Who's Neil? No, me! I'm the third ghost! Uh, look, Brooke, I think of me as the last stop on the train, so let's check in on our results. What have you taken away from this speeding locomotive heading full speed towards your future? I learned that any technology business is good business as long as you're willing to stomp on the backs of others without them noticing. Uh, oh, and that magicians are almost always sad. No, wrong, no, no. Didn't you learn about always keeping your eye on hot markets and, and, and that your passions can become your career with enough fire and an occasional children's birthday party? No, wait, not fair. This is my lesson and I did the best with what I got. I mean, a corrupt CEO and a mediocre magician? Who are you trying to turn me into, evil Knievel? Not evil, nor a magician. I would be lucky if I learned anything from tonight. I mean, all I know is that it's fine that I don't know what I'm doing post-grad. It is A-OK. -okay. I just have to be confident enough to start from scratch because there are crazier people out there who are somehow doing OK. I just have to try a million things, and once I do, I'll find something. I'll find a job where I can gossip with someone named Alexa about our boss's failed marriage and, you know, actually be pretty good at it. <laughs> Did you hear that, MSU? I'm free! What? You learned a lesson on your own with the guidance of a few, you know, old, crazy, insane, passionate people. In fact, Congrats. You didn't have to get me a giant check. And we didn't. Oh. It's really more of a representational form of motivation, like a, a piece of art. But best of luck to you, Brooke. I think anyone coming from this old room is going to do just fine. Now, if I could just introduce you to my new business partner. This is my dog, Dodger. We are going to go serve up tacos for Taco Tuesday. Come along, Dodger. Wow, Brooke, did you throw a party of your own? Yep. By myself, for myself. Well, if there's anyone that really deserves a party here tonight, it's you, Brooke. Yeah, totally. So did you cater? Do you have Panera Bread or...? There's no bread, Claire, no. <laughs> no bread, no coffee. Just me, my wavering ability to adult, and a loose plan of how to figure it all out. Same. 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 Aw, sweet little baby. Got his wings. Oh, wait, no, sorry. <laughs> That's my phone. Um, MSU alert, chemical spill. Oh. Oh yeah. 